But we are joined by another great guest right now, and this is the fabulous Luke. He's been with us before. Hey, Sean, you always right? be smart, Luke. So well, I always get to dress up when you're on the show. I think it's because I, every time I think, shall I dress down? Shall I dress not? And I think my mum's watching. <laughs> I should probably make a bit of effort. So. Well, you're always looking in my Thank you. And One of the reasons we love you being on the show is you bring us some fantastic deals with yeah, Carnival. We try. Absolutely. You? I mean, like I say, uh, well, I say every time I'm here, Igloo, uh, Planet Cruise, and the whole company are one of our biggest agents uh, and we always try to give them the best deals try to give them some sort of exclusivity uh, and you've already mentioned it today the, the way they can package up and really tailor make the yeah. holiday to each customer adding more nights on taking them off flights everything else it, it really does make it great for the customers um, and and carnival i mean this is a company again with such a great reputation yeah i mean the, the biggest cruise line in the world i mean, I mean and yeah. for no reason it's uh it is incredible. I mean, I've been working in cruise for, for near on 10 years. And honestly, like yourself, I've probably done well, 15 to 20 cruises now. And this is the only company that I've ever paid my own money, if you want that, to go on. <laughs> where normally, I'm escorting people and things. And it's so informal. It's so relaxed. It's so do what you want when you want. But it doesn't compromise on any of the quality. It's still a four-star brand with, with absolutely fantastic facilities. And, you know, when we say four-star four in the cruise world, you know, it is, mm -hmm. is, you know, compared to hotels, it's, it's, in my mind, it's five or six uh, yeah, star, uh, isn't it? Honestly, I've stayed in like, some really top end, like hotels all around the world, and no service and facilities and the staff, the food, anything has ever come close to any no. cruise line that I've ever been with. It's just impeccable. Um, now, the, the, the offer that you brought us for this show is a brilliant one because we're actually cruising round the Caribbean. Oh, well, I'll be there next week, but I forgot to mention that. <laughs> um, <laughs> <laughs> but for me, it's one of the best, it is one of the best cruises to do, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, I mean, look, if you're going to do the Caribbean, the best way to do it is on a cruise. I agree. Because why go, I always think with the Caribbean, if you're in a resort and you're on a sunbed, you buy a pool and you don't leave the resort, you could be anywhere. Like yeah. if it's yeah. sunny and you're by a pool, you could be in Spain, you could be in France, you could be anywhere. Whereas in a cruise, you get to experience the whole Caribbean. So we'll take you to large Caribbean islands like Barbados on this cruise to some of the smaller islands. I believe we've got St. Kitts and things yeah. like that. Uh, as well, so you get to see the real Caribbean, in my opinion. Obviously, and this is one of the most popular w cruises that uh, you do. This in, really is. Honestly, in the UK market, this destination, this itinerary, is so, so popular. I mean, we're constantly uh, trying to find ways to, to make it even better for the UK customers. And one thing we've done for 2015, from March onwards, we brought a newer ship. Uh, with more facilities, that's had our latest uh, well, refit. Well, and everything. talking of which, let's have a look. Yeah. So we're going to be aboard the Carnival uh, Liberty, aren't yes. we? Yes. Uh, so this is a fantastic ship, just under 3,000 passengers. Uh, you've got loads and loads of fantastic facilities on board. Really is incredible. We've just spent as a company, I mean, hundreds and hundreds of millions of dollars updating the fleet, which was already top of the range yeah. as it was. Uh, loads of new innovations on board. Uh, you've got fantastic restaurants and it's just the atmosphere everyone is there to have a good time the staff are so friendly you've got fantastic bars i mean the alchemy bar on carnival liberty some of the best cocktails i've ever had anywhere in the world i would uh recommend you and try you're speaking them. from experience oh, right. yeah. <laughs> vast experience on this issue uh, also, i think carnival have got a real reputation for being a really fun yeah, yeah. Line, Definitely. we are we're the fun brand we we really we bring relaxed atmosphere uh, like atmospheric cruising to the masses and it's kind of like if you've always been put off a cruise or because of the formality or because of the stuffiness that you think you're not going to get any of that on board no. carnival it really is the informal fun relaxed cruise line it's like being at a resort that just happens to be at sea i yeah. mean it is with lots more to offer oh so <laughs> honestly i mean i'm exactly the same as you i've never stayed in a resort that even comes close to, to matching a cruise you've got the water park on board, you've got countless different restaurants and bars. I mean, the drinks, the entertainment is incredible. I mean, honestly. Um, I think we're going to be really busy for this one, actually. Yeah. Really busy. Anyway, um, before you're even on that fabulous cruise, we're going to fly you over to Barbados and you're going to be staying in a fantastic hotel, a beach hotel, for three nights. And that is nice just to get you in the mood and the swing of yeah. things, isn't um, it? 
I was going to say. Well, absolutely wonderful. I mean, what's not to like? So you've got a nice sort of flight and you arrive and you can just chill out on the white sand. I've been to Barbados a few times. Yeah, you know it well, don't and you? And yeah. it's absolute heaven. It's exactly what you expect the Caribbean to be, what you dream of before you've ever been. Turquoise, beautiful warm water that laps at your feet. Um, chilled out. The Bayesians are so lovely and friendly and, and but very chilled out. You know, you ask for a cocktail and at first you're still in kind of UK time you're like hurry up and then by the end of the holiday you're as chilled out as them it's wonderful um, just lovely atmosphere loads to go and see and do you can go and look at turtles or you can go to the botanical gardens of course I think for me it's about the beautiful beaches when you first yeah, get there I agree. to be honest I agree. feeling the sand beneath your Absolutely. toes having a rum punch and actually being able to swim in the sea and just have that lovely you know, it's it's hot so bath, isn't it? warm yeah and it's yeah. that sea where you look down and it's so transparent it's extraordinary. You see little fish swimming by you. Wonderful. But anyway. then, of course, we get on the wonderful yes. ship, and the cruise begins after three days of that. You're on this amazing ship, having so much fun, and then you're going to sail on day five into St. Lucia, where I've also been to St. Lucia. My dad got married there when I was about 13. Yeah, really? it was just me and my sisters, and my, my dad and my stepmom. It was really fun. Oh, how lovely. Yes, it was wonderful. My stepmom's called Sally, and the, the lovely lady that married them called her Silly. <laughs> and, uh, never forgotten it and that was in St Lucia on a mountain and it is the most beautiful beautiful place and there's the famous pitons the big mountains up in the background it's just gorgeous so lush and then we are sailing into St Kitts and this is what you're saying Luke you know you're on a cruise some people would go for a week in Barbados okay yeah, yeah lovely but here you've already been to three Caribbean islands. And they are all so different, aren't they? Yeah, and exactly. And I think this is where cruising really does come into an, its own and where someone like Planet Cruise and a product like Carnival, because you were saying three nights uh, in Barbados, yeah. Planet Cruise, you could do more, you yeah, could do less, yeah. you absolutely. could do some at the end of the cruise, but absolutely getting to see such vast uh, differences in, in islands. Yeah, and I just think sailing from island to island uh, is going to be stunning as well. It. And only unpacking once. Yeah. Exactly. So St. Kitts is day six. Day seven, you're then sailing into Philipsburg and St. Martin. Again, a lovely different atmosphere again. I think just sailing on these Caribbean waters mm. as well, the turquoise, uh, beautiful I ocean. I found St. Martin fascinating because one side's Dutch, one side's French. It's only about 26 miles across it. It's really, when you, you go from the Dutch to the French side, it's completely different. Yeah, totally different yeah. Um, uh, character and you've got amazing shopping actually in St Martin as well on duty free um, very pretty though again you just by now you'll be so relaxed you might just want to flop on the beach and then on day eight you're sailing to San Juan which is a great day stop on a cruise um, it's got an amazing old city and most cruise ships dock right in the heart of old San Juan which dates back to the 16th century so again full of character Day nine, you're going to Charlotte Amelie in St. Thomas. Again, here, the duty-free shopping scene is unparalleled. And you've got the world-famous beach at, at Magan's Bay. I went there on my mum's 70th. Oh, yeah, what a forget. treat. It's amazing. Ama it was amazing. Yeah, and you could do a scenic tram ride right to the top of the mountain top as well. Then you've got a day at sea to have some fun and some lovely food. And then day 11, you're back to Barbados, where, unfortunately, your cruise comes to an end. But you do have to go home yeah. at some point. Oh, as Luke said, you know, if you want to spend a few extra days, yeah. Yeah, we can Absolutely. Do that. make it a two-week holiday. Yeah. Just one thing to point out with all those amazing different destinations is the wide range of shore excursions that are available in all of these swimming with dolphins in different ports and all of these different things that on board Carnival we offer that's maybe less traditional than a, a normal cruise company because we're a very mainstream resort type of, uh, of holiday. You have a real mixture of ages as well uh, on board. You do, you? absolutely. Yeah. I mean, you'll see actually the youngest average age across any cruise line. Um, now, but great, great mix of people. Just yeah. to remind you, this is an exclusive offer. Look, always really, you know, looks after the Planet Cruise viewers. So exclusive for Planet Cruise right now. Return flights are all included. We can actually provide those from most UK airports. Uh, again, just ask our call uh, centre for details. You get an extra three nights in that four-star hotel in Barbados and only a deposit on selected departure dates as well. But, as I say, you know, if you need to change any of the, those, uh, you know, details for extra nights, if you don't want to do the pre-night stay in Barbados, we can actually make this bespoke for you, of course, as well. Great prices across there. We have already sold out at the balcony in April. Actually, very good point. On, the, um, on this cruise, you only have a, a, a relatively small number of cabins available on each date, is that right? Yeah, absolutely. It's what we call a, a split sailing because the, the actual sailing would be from San Juan to San Juan. So we, uh, we open up uh, a select group of, of cabins purely just to do this Barbados itinerary because it's so popular. 
But it's also just worth pointing out there, you've got April to November up because of the flights, obviously, 11 months in. But the cruise element is on sale well into 2016, uh, and Planet Cruise will be able to, to sort that out for you I as want well. To go. I want to go. Same here. Same here. <laughs> Luke, can I say thank you so uh, much? It's always thank great you for having me. Chance. No, we love you. Have to come back. Yeah, we will see you very soon. And um, don't forget, you can book that right now, but obviously limited availability.